Hi, my name is Dr. Joanna Shepard and you are actually a part of our Antigua Champions for Health Promoting Schools Packing Day. This is the eighth year that UFE, um, specifically kinesiology, has gone down to the beautiful island of Antigua and we work for four weeks on life skills teaching. Life skills teaching is about conflict resolution, about being respectful, about making good decisions and other things that we need to learn um, because we don't earn them, we learn them. So what we do is we use the power of sport through physical and health education to teach these life skills. But we need to bring all the equipment with us. So every student actually brings 50 pounds of sports equipment, resources we need for the classroom in order to make sure that we have enough resources down there. Well, with having many, many students going down with me this year, we have about 3,500 pounds of resources going down. So thanks for being a part of it, and we're excited. We hope you follow our blog site at healthypromotingschools.ca. No, it's not. It's .com. <laughs> okay, do you think we're ready to go? Okay. Yeah. Should I start talking to the camera? What do you think I should tell them? I don't know. You don't know? No. Okay. So, we are here with our packing day. It's really important that we're bringing all of this equipment down with us because when we get to Antigua, we have to unload it all, blow it all up. It's really important because we are donating this equipment to the schools. And not only are we using it every day in our teaching, but we're also using it for Unity Games, which is like a sports day that we do every Friday with two schools a day. And now, it's not just a sports day, we're doing it with a twist. We're teaching life skills while we're down there. And so it's really important that we're using these games to teach these life skills so that the students that can become better members of society, they can also succeed better at home, at school, and in their relationships. Uh, hi, my name is Christine McGuire, and I'm the curriculum coordinator for Antigua. Um, it's been a grueling process to go over everyone's lesson plans, so my role is to make sure that everyone's lesson plans are up to par, uh, making sure that they are uh, reflecting their life skills. So each school has a specific life skill and making sure that in all of their games uh, and in all their classroom activities that they reflect that life skill because we want to make the biggest impact while we're down there. Um, I preparing for myself, I've stayed calm because going through over a hundred lesson plans gets a little bit confusing at times. Everything starts to melt together but um, going through it and making all the binders now has definitely calmed my nerves especially since there's um, a huge team behind us that helps us with all the coordinating, um, putting all the binders together as you can see, and uh, it's going to be a really exciting trip, but I'm really excited to go. Um, I fell in love with teaching when I went there the first time. It took two weeks in for me to realize that teaching is what I really wanted to do. Um, I was so in love with the kids there and the idea of trying to make a difference and seeing the difference that you can make uh, as a teacher. So going back for a second time is just to kind of give me that power inside to go continue to be a teacher and to strive to be a better teacher as well. Um, also, I want to go back and see the kids that I taught last year because I know that they really wanted me to come back. So the fact that I'm coming back and they don't know is going to be a really good surprise. So, um, yeah, I'm just really excited. I fell in love with the island and I don't think I would ever want to not go back. <laughs>